Yeah, I literally just put in the settings. I haven't messed with the sensitivity or anything with linear. Haven't used it. I, I as soon as the new chapter came out, I tried it or the new settings or whatever. I I tried it for like two seconds, turned it off immediately. Oh gosh, I gotta turn it down, don't I? It it moves. Oh my gosh, it moves so fast. And hey, if you did want to use my supporter creator code, it's phase swan. You can put that in the item shop. And thanks in advance if you do end up doing it. Yeah, we got to make some big adjustments. I, I don't know what to do. Where's the regular sensitivity? Why can't I change that? Make sure your dead zone is 0.10 or higher. And you have to lower your sense. Oh, where's Where's the sensitivity? Oh, the look. Okay. Oh, okay. I feel like that should be even. Maybe not. I don't know. Okay, I think I can turn that up a little bit. Oh, okay. You didn't hear anything. Why doesn't it place that cone? Dampening zero seconds? Okay. Okay, you guys are guiding me through this. Oops, don't need to change that. Where's the dampening? I think I already have that at zero, probably. Oh, look dampening time. Put that at zero? The time it takes to reach the expected look rotation speed after applying initial input to the controller. You feel like a bobblehead when you play linear? That's like the perfect example. I feel like I'm just like up and down specifically it's just like I, i'm not i feel like i gotta change my vertical sensitivity on this yo people people should start doing that i don't know if that actually helps like Enough free building. I'm not a I'm not a free builder. I'm garbage at free building. Let me just let me just see. If... Wait, I want to get I want to learn this edit fast, and then poof. You just gotta go. Nope. Nope. Come on. Nope. There we go. Oh, okay. That feels a lot better now. Why do I feel like my edits like are, are hitting, but they're not hitting? There we go. Boom. I'm telling you, dude. Just... Hit him with that. Alright, well, let's try a game. I don't know, I feel like I've found decent settings, so I'm gonna try it. I have no idea what the aim is gonna be like. So, let's see what it is. I don't know. It's good for shotgun shots, really? Oh, that is not good for uh, aiming. Oh, I would have hit him. Ah! Okay. I do kind of like that you can just just look around super quick with shotguns. Yeah, I can see how it would be good for flicks. It, dude, it's so it's so touchy. It, it's like I barely move it, and it just moves a ton. Alright, well, there's the first game. Ooh. 
Wow. Okay, that aim was kind of nuts. That just, like, felt right. But that was, like, the first one where it was like, holy moly, I actually just hit all those. Jesus, what's going on here? No mats, bro. Oh my gosh, why? Oh, uh, that's what you call it. deleting someone. Oh, he had a loadout and a half, too. I'm telling you, dude. Aiming is so bad. Go hiding. Might as well just use one. All right, bet. There we go. Edits are pretty nice though on this. It feels cool. It feels different because I don't think you can have edit mode aim assist on this with these settings. Um, and I use edit mode aim assist typically. Editing feels easier. Yeah, editing does feel easier, but everything else, like long range, I, I feel like I'm not getting like nearly enough aim assist. I'm telling you right now, as of right now, later, I'm gonna switch back. Like I, I don't even want to stick with it because aiming is such a key part of my game. Like if I was maybe if I was a creative warrior and I was like just nuts at building. Then I would think about it just because editing and all the, everything feels better. But like, aim is like my my apex of skills for the most part. what you get there we go there we go
Is that a bot? Nice, dude. Bots always got the the mats. Yes, we're gonna play like this. Everyone has an RPG nowadays. Come on, man. Come fight me, box fight me, something. Let's go, let's go. I thought I was done for. Oh my Lord, dude, I hate these settings. I'll play a few more, but I'm not staying on these settings. That aim was so lucky that I headshotted him. Let's see what my... I want to see actually what my accuracy was. I'm guessing... I mean, I'm guessing it was decent, but I'd say probably... 23. Tw I was going to say 21. Dang. 21. Hey, let's go. 11. I'll take that. I struggle to get 10 kills when I win, every win, because I'm running around the entire time, and I still barely find anyone. The thing is, the the main thing about it that I don't like is the aiming. And it, the thing about it is, it, when I'm using regular legacy settings, no advanced settings or whatever, it, aiming just comes naturally. I think in, aiming should always come naturally. You should never adapt to like a new aiming system. And this, sure, it might be good for building. I My builds felt really good. My edits felt really good. But no, it's not worth it. It's not worth it. If you're a creative warrior and you just post creative videos and just stuff like that, yeah, you're going to love it. You're going you're, you're gonna to love it. But personally, I do not like linear. I'm switching back. I hope it didn't screw up, screw with my regular sensitivity. I hope it's all right. But yeah, these are my settings. I'm going to toss this at the end of the video just to show my final settings that I had. 1.5, 1 1.5, 1 uh, 50, 49, 0, 0, 0, instant boost when building off, ADS 2424, and... Dampening zero, ramp time zero, linear, aim assist strength 100%. There you have it. And I say, okay, I see people in chat telling me that my ADS is too high. I like playing on a high ADS. When I use the regular old settings, I, I play on a high ADS and I can track people really well. And aim assist feels great from distances. It doesn't feel good from distances. And ADS, I don't like slow ADSs at all. Uh, I don't like it being too slow. It's a no for me, dog, but to each their own. Oh my gosh, this gun's a laser. You nice, could not crazy. do this on linear. 